touch me. I don't want any of you near okay, me. Okay, kid, take it easy. Take it easy. I'm getting out of here. I'm getting out of here. All right, kid. Okay, we'll talk <coughs> about it later. I don't want to talk about it later. I want to transfer right now. Doug, listen to me. <coughs> there are no more transfers. You'll have to wait till next time. I'm sorry. <coughs> you got to stay here after this, huh? If you want to graduate. <coughs> you know, I'll help you as much as I can. Man, you discriminated against me just like they do. I mean, you downgraded my papers. You're not giving me the grades I deserve. Man, you discriminated against me because I'm white. Now, Doug, stop. Because I'm white. Stop getting paranoid. Yeah, because I'm white. Now, look. Don't tell me about discrimination. You know I, I just, see it? Just don't. You know I see it? They can't stand being shown up. They quit before they start. So they take it out on me. And you're doing the same thing. Man, you guys really stick together, don't you? Oh, you're all alike. All right. That's it. Break it up. It's all over. Let's go. Defending the white folks. Man, you just like them darkies on TV. Gang up time, eh, JT? Real tough. Oh, look, man. Why don't you just hustle on back where you came from? We got these honkies on the run down here. stuff. Maybe it's because as a kid I didn't eat anything but. Go on. I grew up playing basketball right around the corner. Where? Oh, you know, I made a, a hook from a clothes hand, attached it to a lamppost so I'd have enough light. I'd be out there shooting 10, 12 hours a day. Even in college, it was all basketball. <laughs> Seven days, 40 hours a week. It was my whole life. Didn't you ever do anything but play ball? Nope. Oh, sure, the coach said education came first. But you won or you were out. I mean, books, forget it. I never read a thing I wasn't forced to until one day I picked up a copy of Treasure Island. <laughs> you know, I stayed up all night reading it. Got so caught up in it, I couldn't stop. And then I just read myself right through the public library. Books, man, just blew my mind. And after that, well, I took a different road. Because you didn't want other kids to miss what you had found, right? No, I never thought about that. I... Yeah, I guess so. And look where it got you. Lafayette High School. Could be worse. Could it? Oh, come on. You're a teacher. Oh, well, thank you for telling me, Mr. Davis. Where have you been? I've been there four years, and I'm telling okay. you, it is hopeless. Okay. There are no answers, and nothing works down there. Well, damn it, let's find something that does. Are you kidding? With those old fogies downtown running the show? Hell, they're riding into the sunset. Well, they're taking their own damn sweet time about doing it. Look, I don't know what the answers are, but I'll tell you one thing. If the mold doesn't fit the kids, then maybe we should break the goddamn mold and save the kids. Today we're going to pay, turn to page number eight. And oh, uh, Mr. Davis? Yes? Roger Thornbush, the State Board of Education. Hi. <laughs> the story of my life. You don't know why I'm here. Well? I'm conducting a test. Test? What sort of test? Oh, simply trying to gauge the comparative achievement levels in some of our schools. We, uh, we sent you a letter about it. Oh, yes. Mr. Thornbush, I'm sorry, but I'd rather not. I mean, this test may do something for you and the board, but not for my class. Mr. Davis, I have my instructions. In that case, I'd have to take it up with the principal. I already have. Now, do you all understand? All
All I want is a simple definition for some words. Well, we'll start with, uh, with this young lady and work back. Collateral. Collateral. Uh. Uh. <laughs> uh, uh. Next, Utopia. Utopia? Utopia. That, that, that's some kind of uh, special place, like, uh, I don't know. Next, incentive. Goal, motivation. Very good. Next, turgid. Oh, yeah, yeah. I know. He's a kid live upstairs. Mean mother. <laughs> Next, thermofax. Man, how come every test we get these same old bullshit words? Mr. Davis. Yes? Next, automated. Oh, man, leave me alone. Ask the honkies. Next roll, escalation. I think that's enough testing, Mr. Thornbush. Mr. Davis, I haven't finished. Oh, yes, you have. Now, no, just a minute. Mr. Davis. No, hey, no. Hey, wait a minute. Okay, okay. Now, I know that test shot some of you down. But just because you don't know the meaning of words like thermofax and utopia doesn't mean you can't cut it. It all depends on what's been available to you. What you're into. Whether your folks come from Connecticut or Georgia. Dig? Now, just to show you what I mean, let's have another go at a test that's not in the book. Carter, what's a low rider? Why, sh everybody knows that. Th that's when you got your bad mobile and, and you set it down low to the ground and take off. Say that. <laughs> What's going into a knock? It means you're on the drugs, man. Doug, who was Wallace D. Fudd? I don't know. Dupre. Well, that's the cat that started the Muslims. Who's Irvine? He, 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 he's the first. What's working the route? That's, that's old folks casting spells. Who died on February 21st? Uh, uh, Malcolm. 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 I bought a gun in. Uh, Swahili for good morning. What's happening, man? Lowering your box. Playing your M and F fam. Matt and Tat. Mind pa. A hog. A cat like. And what's lye and potato pills used for? That's for frying your cock. <laughs> okay. So now we know just how much you all have on the ball. But you're gonna have to have a lot more. Because there's all kinds of books and ideas and words. And you're going to learn about them, all of you, black and white. And there will be no exceptions and no excuses. Clear? Beautiful. Hello, Greg. Hi, afternoon, Johnson. Uh, how is everything? Fine. Glad to hear. Uh -huh. Well, listen, I got some reading to do. Reading? Is that right? Uh huh. You know, I'm very interested in your reading, Johnson. Tell me about it. It's okay, man. The tell. I'm in a hurry, Mr. Davis. Oh, what? I got a class that teaches a hard nose. Oh, Ooh, you. <laughs> No sweat, then, huh? I mean, if I'm here, you can't be late, can you? Uh -uh. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, I want to see you after class. Okay, I'm going to be there. Uh, you promise? I promise uh, I'm going to be there. Johnson, don't let me down. I'm not going to let you down. Cross my heart, hope to die. I'm thinking of your mind, I'm going to be there. All man. right, Johnson. Bye. Go on, then. <laughs> Mr. Johnson. Look, that wasn't no grass you saw me smoking. That's not what I want to talk to you about. Oh, I got to be to work by five. I know. What kind of work you do, Johnson? Cleaning out air conditioning ducts downtown. Is that what you want to do? 
Look, if you're white, you right. If you're brown, hang around. But if you're black, get back. That's where it's at. Not if you push your way to the front and hold on tight. Oh, yeah, I know. It's been done. Sure. You're going to tell me about Bill, Cosby, Carl, Stokes, and O.J., but you cats are super spooks. You make it anywhere, anytime. All I'm asking you to do is try. And you can't try until you know how to read. I'm making it. Like hell. Hey, man, give me some slack. Whitey reads. Oh, man, not that damn baby book again. It's no baby book. Then it's William Cullen Bryant. Every time I hear one of them dudes with them three names, I goes under. Come on, Johnson. It's not what you think. Read. He pulled her to him, her body soft but firm. Then he felt press of her full, heavy <laughs> Ray Johnson. Her full, heavy breath and her, her sigh with pleasure. He felt the warmth rising into his lion loins. Into his loins. And kissed her. She Oh man, you gotta be kidding. Read Johnson. Okay with me. She reached for his manhood and gasped with delight. Outside, the trees shook in the wind. <laughs> oh, God, no. I didn't know it would be like this, she whispered. He had never known a woman so... Insatiable. Insatiable. Softly at first, she moaned. The moan rising as her body clung to his as her body clung to his her silken thighs writhing her fingernails clawing his back oh man come on in well what can i do for you uh i just thought i'd sit in and listen a while you know me too Mm-hmm. Well, if you want to stay, you got to play. Rules of the game. That's it. Go ahead. As their desire reached it's pit, pi pineapple, pinnacle, pinnacle. Her whole body shuddered against his. Don't stop, she cried. Go ahead, I'm listening. Suddenly, he felt a strange since sensation sensation she had taken a piece of ice and jammed it into his flaming 